Firstly, who is this vagabond asking this kind of question? That who is prettier, Bob Whiskey or DJ Copy? You are comparing a real woman to an artificial one. Come on, man. That is so, so disrespectful to womenhood. Come on. You do not ask such questions. You are comparing a real woman who is going through the normal process of being a woman. Who is going through life, going through transformation? Come on, man. Huh? Come on, you are disrespecting copy. Real bad. Someone said that seems like insult. You compare a real lady to an unreal man. Kindly compare people in his league with him. Come on. Well, I mean no disrespect to the sugar mommy of Lagos. That is the person of uh, but risky, I mean, no disrespect to her at all. So, we th before we go further, guys, try as much as possible. Firstly, to like that video, click on that like button, comment as you watch, and uh, also invite your loved ones to participate. You no, know, to participate, please like and uh, click the subscribe, uh, click the subscribe button, and comment as well. So, guys, uh, no disrespect to the sugar mommy of Ninja. Uh, that is uh, the person that for Bob Risky. She is good. She is good looking. All is good looking. And is going through what he said he wanted or she wanted to go through. And he actually did some level of surgery. And you know in Nigeria, and yet we keep saying, oh, Nigeria do not support LGBTQ. Nigeria government supports LGBTQ. Yeah. Our federal government supports LGBTQ. That law you saw there is just formality. We support LGBTQ wholeheartedly. Any of you who come here to speak that we don't support it, man, you guys are, you guys should really know what you are saying because <laughs> if you know a country that do not support it, you will know, not Nigeria. So that being said, the Sugar Mommy of Lagos lists out a 2024 new list. She said, if you want to, it's a mommy of Lagos price increased. Just to say hi to her. Just to say hi, hello, Bob Risky. You're going to pay $2,000. Ah, <laughs> then she said, you want to hug mommy of Lagos. If you want to hug her, Bob Risky, you're going to pay $5,000. <laughs> then you want to peck mommy of Lagos. You want to peck her, you're gonna pay ten thousand US. That's a ten million era. Then short time, if you want to have short time with mommy of Lagos, you want to take her home to bang her from the back, you will pay bang in from the back, you're gonna pay hundred thousand US dollars, hundred million naira for short time. Ah, oh, hundred million naira for your time. Then overnight, with mommy of Lagos, you want her to one in to stay behind your house to bang her really well, like three rounds. Because overnight, usually, usually take three rounds. For those of you who are familiar with the business, if you carry gear, you book gear, you just fifteen thousand naira or twenty thousand naira. It's already cut her. Maybe if you say twenty five thirty, you don't price and go fifty thousand, five thousand naira for your time. Yeah, overnight, where I expect to get good, like three good rounds. One round before you sleep, in the, in the night, another round again. Then uh, early in the morning, give another round again. That is making like uh, three rounds. So she said that three rounds now, 300,000 US dollars for her. That's like 300 million naira. Then if you want to marry her, that means you will have to buy. If you say she want to marry mommy of Lagos, no price yet. <laughs> oh no! <wow. laughs> oh, this word there. Uh, what is this word turning to? Damn it! What is this word turning into? Oh. Well, that being said, let's talk about. One of one of uh, well decor decorated 
Africa footballer, Sergio Mani. Sergio Mani recently married. I was thinking Sergio Mani, as rich as he is, is going to marry one fine or Yubo woman. But guess what? This man go in village, go pick, marry a 18 years old girl, Sergio Mani. Went to his village to marry a 18 years old girl. Well, she's just ripe enough. The girl is still in school. The girl, in fact, after the wedding, the girl went back to school and you saw how they were praising her, singing her a congratulatory song. Sadio Mane, 18 years old girl. As a man is a Muslim, please, I don't know, you guys might have uh, your own thought towards that age, but obviously, Okay, you know what? I shouldn't even want to talk about that age anymore because you know you you don't even know where these rules and regulations will come from. 18 years old is it appropriate? Because Sergio Mane is like 32, 33, 34, I don't know, 31, 32, 33, 34 years old. And now he reportedly married a 18 years old girl. Never had any kid, never was married before, was never in an open relationship, like a relationship that we know that is well uh, publicized never was never in a relationship before and the crazy part is Sergio Mane is wealthy he's rich how come this man is so humble even the wedding picture doesn't even look as professional as it's supposed to be it seems like this guy hired his village people to take care of the wedding ceremony, to take care of the, the, the car hired, everything was around his village. The decoration of the party was his village people. So this is a man eh, who really loves, loves to assist his village people. This guy already built a stadium, built a healthcare center, provided boil holes all over his village. Provided a uh, a a yeah a, a, a night post, a post office. So many things this guy has provided that is yet even named. This guy pays salary monthly to most homes in his village, and he wanted to marry. He allowed his village people. He employed those specialties in his village. The decoration, the Pictures. That is why the picture are not so that they do not are not so quality like you want them to be, like the one from my other side uh, abroad. This white man, Sergio Mane, is truly so one sent from heaven. Not every man can keep calm like Sergio Mane. Not every man that has such money can keep calm like Sergio Mane. Talking about our own superstars over here. I'm not saying they are not doing so much. Oh. Recently, they were comparing Sergio Mane with uh, Vito Sime. <laughs> well, our superstars are busy going to club, flexing money, and throwing out a uh, 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 dollar and naira on the strippers and club goers. Meanwhile, we have a lot of others. Or some of them are able to spray money in the street. None of them is really committed to assist. Let's be honest. Uh, nobody is really committed to build something to the for the society. They have money, they just want to just spray money and just go and relax and take care of themselves. Nobody is actually really committed to build a legacy for himself. It's not as if our musicians, our uh, our superstars over here do not give. They give freely, but they are not committed. They are not drive to create a legacy. They only drive to create legacy for themselves, for to make money and uh, chill create a source of income for themselves but to actually leave a legacy for themselves in their own community they are not drive by that they are just preoccupied they do not have that zeal like Sergio Mane the best player in the world to me is Sergio Mane let that clear man let that be clear Sergio Mane the best player to me eh, in the world and that being said, let's talk about Very Darkman. Very Darkman was trying to narrate what happened between himself, Tonto DK, and another woman, Yabojo, at the police station in Abuja. But guess what? He also insinuated 
say that Tuntun DK is is uh, the popular uh, blogger called Gist Lover. He said the whole heartedly, yes, that Tuntun DK is Gist Lover. Listen, guys. Because Tonto DK is just lovers. Yes, because immediately as they released the video, just lover done my picture up on station, just lover and I first post them. So when she go outside, she send her go a second account, go schedule them. Tonto DK is just lovers. And I can prove more go court anywhere, anytime. Tonto DK is just lovers. She has been the one posting different celebrities, news, and everything. With my full chest, I'm saying it today. So this is the person that wants to hold political office so that, okay, when they don't do anything where she like, person like that, fit by person, you know, see the way she wants that to treat me online. So we'll go see for outside. You, I don't talk him. Um, unless by appointment for Nigeria with you old office. If it are by vote, I go bab my hair, I go remove my nose ring, everything, I go contest against you. And of course, I go stand. With these streets, now we know what our people want. Now we know what in Nigeria they go through. What are you all about? Posting bleaching cream without an attack. That is what you start. Well, he said it went to DK is this lover. Well, I think. I don't know. I don't know the issue. See, the issue with uh, the DK Yabojo and uh, very dark man started all the time, all the way from Mobad when the uh, Yabojo and the uh, DK carried Mobad issue on top of their head and uh, they were trying to stigmatize Naramali. So, very dark man wasn't happy with that. <laughs> so, that is the whole issue from that side. Well, I hope they sort out their whole issue and uh, who knows? There might be friends in the future.